What's going on everybody? It's Tim and we are finally through that three day weekend and I wanted to talk about Clean Spark. We recently had our mining update. I was totally asleep at the wheel. For me, weekends are pretty busy, but let's get into this. I think they gave a really good mining update and we're also going to look at some price action on the chart. And if you like these videos, don't forget to like, subscribe, hit the notification bell and let's look at Clean Spark. Now, as for their Bitcoin mining update, they just got to 3.4 exahash. For those of you that watch this talk very closely, you'll remember that just a few days ago, they gave an update that they reached three exahash. Well, I think this huge increase is due to their recent acquisition acquisition of that facility they bought and they did mention that they bought miners in place there already but looking at their numbers here you'll see that in august they mined 395 bitcoin which is up over 109 percent year over year and they have mined a whopping 2642 bitcoin in the year now it's good news that they are holding more bitcoin than previously they are now holding 526 and they converted 388 which was actually nine percent less than the previous month that's a good sign to me and another great thing you might see is they did sell their bitcoin at an average of twenty three thousand dollars per bitcoin every time Every time with these guys, seems like they're selling at the right moment, at least in terms of short-term price action. But they did get close to $9 million for selling the Bitcoin that they sold that month. Here's something else that's big that no one's probably mentioning. Technical crews in Washington, that was their recent acquisition, have worked around the clock to bring miners online. Since closing in late August, there are now over 6,000 miners online out of the over 10,000 on site. The company expects to energize the remaining miners next week next week and they also just received a new president of mining technology and this taylor monig was actually recently working at tmg core which is another bitcoin miner but he brings about eight years of experience in the bitcoin mining industry which is a great thing for clean spark now i personally think that you couldn't ask for anything better for this mining update and i just realized i didn't tell you what they mine per day now they reached a high of 13.39 bitcoin mine per day which is definitely an increase over their last mining update but there's definitely some great things going on for clean spark now let's look at the chart and see if some great things are going on there First off, I wanted to zoom out a bit and just show you that we have been in this downtrend and we are looking at a possible downtrend reversal very soon. But keep in mind that the low was priced in at 380, so if we drop that level, it may fall further. Now, as of late, you definitely want to watch this downward trend that's been started since the 25th of August, and that's these white lines here. But like I said, we do have support of 380. Definitely watch that level. If we break that, that's not good news. It did hit it three times. But you all know how I feel about Clean Spark. And technical wise, you know, as long as this holds this 380, I have reason to believe that we will reach that downtrend reversal very soon. Now, it would definitely be great to have Bitcoin working with Clean Spark rather than against it. You'll see that we've been on this continuous downtrend. It is very encouraging to see that it at least held that $19,000 support. And you're going to want to watch this wedge pattern here. It's very possible we break out in either direction. Now, you also have to keep this white line in mind as well. This is our potential downtrend reversal we may break out of. Same with Clean Spark, very similar chart pattern. But that's basically it for you guys. How do you feel about Clean Spark's recent mining update? I am extremely impressed. I'm also impressed with where they sold their Bitcoin at, and their strategy remains sound. But let me know what else you guys are watching in the market this week. Thanks as always, and take it easy.